If you're remodeling your bathroom and you're thinking about removing your bathtub and buying a new one, just stop right there because I'm going to show you a great alternative to going through all of the expense and labor and headaches and everything associated with removing a bathtub and putting in a new one. Instead, we're going to show you how the professional come in and reglaze your bathtub and make it look new. So we're going to show you how we're going to transform this bathtub from looking like this here that you see on the screen and we're going to transform it into this. So here is our victim, a worn down bathtub. A professional contractor that does this on an everyday basis because those kits and stuff that you buy in the big box stores are just very, very cheap alternatives, much higher quality product. So we normally have a five year guarantee on the work. So what we do is you want to remove all of the hardware first. So we've already removed the drain and we've also removed the overflow. Remember the overflow vent goes right there. Tub spout, I got it out of the way just to give them better room to maneuver. So here we are, we've got it all taped up and yet the protective paper is in place. Everything here is all taped off and we even have this tight spot back in here. Start sanding it down and they're gonna spray it later. They'll primer it first with a high quality primer and then they'll put the coating on. and smooth almost like self-leveler you know yeah it has a self-leveler you don't want to leave any clubs any lines or anything okay so now with the just the primer on it already looks a lot better so this will dry for a little while, and then the enamel will get sprayed right on top. That shows how much dust was inside that house. So when he's spraying the bathtub, you're going to see a big mist of that. All of the overspray and stuff will come out of here. So that that fan in there is that vacuum fan in there is going to be drawing it all out here because you don't want it floating around inside the house. And that's why we turn off the air conditioner as well, so that none of the paint or anything gets sucked up into the filters or onto the coil of the air conditioner. And here it is after spraying. It's all brand spanking new. It looks like a brand new tub, nice and shiny. Three layers of enamel spray on there. So the, the bottom one, which blows the air, it gets hot. The air gets hot when it blows out, when it gets warmed up. That's about uh, 1600 bucks. And the gun is like 350. So is it, when it blows on there, is it warm when it's blowing on? True working car right here, man. When you buy a car like this, it's meant for work only. So you don't. This car is a chick magnet. This car is a money maker. Okay, so now we've put all new hardware on, and we're checking for leaks. We even raised up the shower head because before it was coming down here, it was too low. But man, this looks perfect.
and out here at the end you can feel that positive pressure of all of the air coming out and now where we are we can actually smell it coming through here too so it's exhausting out all of that that overspray that's in the air right now Uh, just last week I had to tell one of our lady friends who who wanted me to come in and swap out her bathtub and I'm like you know swapping out a bathtub is not as easy as you think it is not a trivial task at all because a lot of people forget that a bathtub has a lip around it right and so you have to rip out that whole bottom row of tiles all the way around the bathtub and you can see how the bathtub is just perfectly wedged in there right so you need all of that space You'll likely have to remove the door. Maybe you can get away without it. But you'll probably have to remove some of these tiles here. Maybe you have a little bit of a wall that juts out, and you would have to remove all of that. And remember, you have to put it all back when you're done, too. But, you know, you're looking at days of work. So really, I only suggest to people to swap out a bathtub if you're doing a full gut, meaning the entire walls are coming down and everything, all the old tiles, the old walls because it is very difficult to get a bathtub up and then flipped that way and out the door. Hey, and you know what folks, if you're finding this video useful so far, hey, do us a favor, would you please give us a thumbs up down below that tells us that you like us. And if you have not subscribed to this channel yet, man, you see all of this great world-class content that we upload for you, all of these great videos on remodeling your homes, we cover all sorts of in-depth categories like covering your kitchens and installing cabinets and all sorts of other videos on remodeling your bathrooms as you can see here we help you deliver the best bathroom you could possibly get uh, installing tile throughout your house how to install wood flooring laminate flooring we also cover engineering disasters you might find through your house and we also do these great tool review videos for you that you're accustomed to seeing and you know we do all sorts of thorough testing and drop testing of the tools so that you can tell whether you're getting a quality product or not. And we also give you all of those great walkthroughs of the hardware stores, finding you the best tools at the best prices. So if you haven't subscribed yet, do that right now while it's fresh on your mind. Click that subscribe button below and click the gray bell icon next to it. That tells YouTube to alert you whenever we upload a video or go live. That way you don't miss out. Well, thank you so much for tuning in today, folks. And we'll see you on the next one.